I might throw up on you. You're doing fine. <laughs> you don't seem afraid at all. I don't understand that. Well, fear is sort of an odd thing. When I was in residency, my first solo procedure was a spinal surgery on a 16-year-old kid, a girl. And at the end, after 13 hours, I was closing her up, and I, I accidentally ripped her dural sac. It's right at the base of the spine where all the nerves come together. Membrane is thin as tissue. And so it, it ripped open. <laughs> The nerves just spilled out of her like angel hair pasta. Spinal fluid flowing out of her. And I... And the terror was just so crazy. So real. And I knew I had to deal with it. So I just made a choice. I'd let the fear in, let it take over, let it do its thing. But only for five seconds, that's all I was gonna give it. So I started to count. One, two, three, four, five. And it was gone. I went back to work, sewed her up, and she was fine. If that had been me, I think I would have run for the door. No, I don't think that's true. You're not running now.